squinty. Okay, this squinty energy. I'm going to turn my humidifier. Let me just kind of do this. Okay. So, hey, Cancer. <laughs> so, this is Cancer's reading today. Um, this is a random reading. Be keep in mind, you could be reverse energies. So you could be a masculine but have more feminine, and your significant other could have more masculine than feminine in their chart. Take with you what resonates, throw away what doesn't, because it could be for somebody else. This reading might not resonate at all, but it can guide you in your life. Personal readings will be in stock in the year of 2030 or when I have 30,000 30, plus supporters. Thank you. I love y'all so much. Pages makes, ugh, pages makes perfect. Okay. So, um, sun, moon, rising, Venus, whatever is in your chart, make sure you look at your chart and see if you have any cancer. This could be your, for your significant other. Um. Or it might it might resonate with you. You like your name might be here. It be it might be something that resonate with you. But don't try to make it your story, Cancer, because I know y'all take things emotionally. So don't try to like make it your story when it's not your story. Just saying. Okay. Um, because we got this card, love in reverse. You're not showing yourself self love attraction affection like what's going on cancer or this could be somebody that's in your energy mm, excuse me but i feel like somebody's not showing itself unconditional love oneness like this is not about a relationship this is about true cancer so you need to grow up and and, and like like, I'm a totally different tarot reader. Like, Cancer, y'all need to really grow up and, and have common sense because at the end of the day, nobody is not going to have you but you. So, y'all need to stop trying to be emotional for other people and be clingy and, and, you know, trying to do everything for yourself. When in reality, you need to love yourself. You need to do stuff that you love, that you love to do. Not for somebody else. Do stuff for you, what you like. Okay, so you will be showered with praise today. This might not be for you. This might be for somebody else. Um, but be careful because no matter how excited you are to celebrate your achievements, there may be someone in your circle who is jealous of your success. Your friend will need your support today. So your friend, your best friend. I'm hearing that best friend song by uh, Doja Cat and Sweetie. So go and listen to that song. But your friend will need your support today so you know text them call them make sure they're okay uh, tell them that you know love them you supporting them be patient and be careful not to pro uh, patronizing patronizing when you give them advice so don't be trying to over say it like be patient because i'm be patient because Y'all guys can be a little too shysty and, like, just get out of control a little bit. Y'all be impatient. So be patient and be careful not to over give them information. Oh, this could happen. Oh, like, y'all be doing a little too much. So, like, be be um, more mature and more wise to your advice. It's a good day for socializing and a new acquaintance you meet today might grow into a strong bond. So anybody that you meet today could be a strong bond today. Daily affirmation, I am always ready to learn and grow in my job. Your number today is six, so that could be your favorite number. Moon and Gemini, it's time for a good haircut, skin care, business, wedding, and I don't recommend a dentist today. Financial operations are bound to be successful. Favorable time for education. Energy is the now the key for Moon and Gemini. Okay, let's get it to y'all reading. 
So this could be the energies around you. Um, this don't got to significantly be for you, Cancer. Okay. Let's get into these names. So we have Adeline. We got Ella. These could be nicknames, your spousal, your uh, spouse, you know, your other lover name, Starlet, family members, Maximus. Beyonce can resonate. Beyonce. So you can listen to Beyonce. You probably look up to her. You are inspired by her. Beyonce. You could feel inspired today. Inspirational today. Sincere. You could be at, um, very sincere. You could look up that word. Peyton. It's more of a word not than a uh, name. You got Erica. Exactly how it's spelled. We got Usher. So Usher can resonate. I'm hearing that let it burn let it burn song. Be careful who you uh who you lay up with. DC Young Fly. Somebody can have something. DC Young Fly could be somebody significant to you. He's a wild and out if you want to go search him up. DC Young Fly. We got Tucker, Chris Tucker, you can look up him too. We got um, Eliana. Jamarcus. Oh, we got Sagittarius. So that's probably why you're dealing with a Sagittarius. We're going to see. Gianna. We gonna see Cancer, Delilah. This could be a family member. Twenty six, twenty six can resonate. Space coop like E T. <laughs> Y'all can't really see that. It's an E and the T. We got P ten. Thomas, Thomas and friends, so you could be chilling with your friends, you probably like chocolate, <clears throat> Everett, you could be, um, I just had my throat chakra, so somebody could be want, wanting to communicate, but they're not communicating with you right now, they probably want to uh, see if you communicate first, is what I'm getting, Dominic. You probably coughing up your words. Miles. Because my throat chakra was like literally was like stuck up. Aaliyah. Gracie. Cameron. This is the name. You are, so you are beautiful, you are smart, you are courageous, you are handsome, you are, this could be in your um, initials, this could be letters in your name, Jackson, 35, Jersey numbers, 37, uh, name, um, ages, Jasmine, Kevin, AQ, Chase, this could be Chase Bank, is what I'm getting, you could be going to the bank, or you need to go to the bank, Chase, or that could be somebody name. we got Giovanni, WB, 
I mean, BW, somebody got a BMW, London, somebody could go to London, this could be your name, we got YT, YJ, YJ, and I'm here, how you keep flossing like I do, why you keep flossing like I do, that's that song by, um, Chloe, Have Mercy, February could be significant. So Valentine's Day. Somebody you probably want a chocolate on Valentine's Day from a Sagittarius. Is what I'm getting. You probably got some something else from this person other than that. You got Pinin. I feel like you did you probably did get something from this person. This Sagittarius or this person that got got Sag highly highly aspected in their chart. They could be a Sag or they could have it highly aspected in their chart. You probably wanted you probably wanted some chocolate or you probably um had chocolate on February by this person. We got Jackson. I feel more of you wanted it. Be grateful for what you already have, Cancer. Because y'all be kinda ungrateful. K U A four. VZ We got D4 UW L3 AJ Fifty nine QL F5 Where is it? Oh, that's S. Where is it? Oh, no, that's 5. That's F5. L11 L11 GP CL UD A D, I mean A Y. <laughs> that song stuck in my head. Cl uh, Clo, uh, have have mercy. G R. So somebody needs to go listen to that song. I'm gonna go listen to it because it's stuck in my head. Literally, we got F four. And like people around here just like, oh y'all, that's for story time. S L. Oh, we got Aquarius. So you could be a y'all could be a cross cross watching. So you could be a Sagittarius in the Aquarius uh, cross watching this. So y'all need to go watch y'all reading too. Sagittarius and Aquarius, y'all need to go watch y'all reading if y'all are cross uh, cross watching. Um, cause I already have it up for y'all too. And we got Jasmine. So we had Jasmine twice. It just spelled different. That's why I'll be showing y'all the card. Um, That's why I'll be showing y'all the. Um, it could be a tower moment. So I'll be that smart you But um, the Grinch could be significant. You could like that show, the uh, movie. But I feel like a Sagittarius and a Aquarius, y'all could be dealing with a Cancer, or it could be reversed. Somebody could have could have been somebody X. Or y'all could have that highly aspect in y'all chart of um cancer. So we got king, kings on the kings on the ring. <laughs> we got keys on the ring. So you got many options, cancer. That's what I'm getting with the Sagittarius and Aquarius here. So I got Sag and I got Aquarius. So you could have many options, cancer. You probably wanted chocolate for both of them. We already got February too, so this could happen Valentine's Day. It could have been this Aquarius birthday in February. He probably couldn't do nothing, but the Sagittarius probably did something for you. He probably got you chocolate. You probably wanted more than that. This could have been a one night stand. 
a conventional string alone, one night stand. We got sabotage. Um, it wasn't sabotage, because sabotage is in reverse. Heart with the key, welcoming, welcoming love, meeting the other. Open your heart, getting together, perfect. So you could be getting together with someone. It could be Aquarius, a Sag. They could have that, have that highly aspect in a chart. But yeah, I feel like Cancer, you need to focus more on yourself. Because you could want, 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 but you ain't giving, giving, giving to yourself. So like, I feel like you need to buy yourself chocolate. You need to buy yourself some candy, you know, flowers, whatever you like. And just stay to yourself. I don't feel like you need to be a uh, one. Night. I feel like you don't need to be doing no one night stands and type of. You trying to find somebody, but you don't need nobody. All you have is yourself. That's all you need. Um, you could be not healing too. Is what I'm getting. You could be not healing from the past relationship. So you try to find other people to like flirt with and stuff. You falling for them deeply too is what I'm getting. You could be falling for them deeply, but you trying to do like you trying to um have a cold heart, but in reality y'all love a lot. Y'all can love a little too much. Y'all could be too clingy. You know. So y'all can love a little too much here. But um I feel like you just need to focus on yourself. And get that self-love and self-care to yourself that you want to give to other people. Because you have many options is what I'm getting. So you could be dealing with a Leo. This could have been from the past relationship. This symbol has like a little line on the top. And we got seven. We got eight. You could be having some communication with these people. We got two. You need to balance yourself. We got six. Reflect on yourself. Got 19. Got 20. Got seven again. So you could be having, uh, yeah, seven, seven is love. So you need to love yourself, Cancer. One, two, three. You could be getting a lot of love. A lot of love donations. You could be 24. Yeah, you could be getting a lot, of, a lot of love, a lot of dedication, too. So it could be the other way around, too, Cancer. But let's flip some cards out on this unconditional love in reverse. What is this love in reverse for Cancer? We're going to figure it out right now. This could be somebody around you, too. So if you feel like, if you give yourself love, some dedication to yourself, this could be somebody around you. So what is love in reverse? Okay, I see a king of pentacles. So you could have cancer heavy aspect in your chart. You could be an earth sign or you could have earth in your chart. Or you could have a lot of money. So this could be for Sagittarius, Aquarius, or this could be for you, uh, Cancer. If you are a woman watching... If you're a woman, um, there could be another uh, opportunity you're going towards. This person could have a lot of money. Um, there's also this person that's showing themselves self-love. They could be working with you. They could be working on trying to get to know you. Yeah. They could have got heartbroken. So whoever you do, if you deal with somebody else here, this person got heartbroken. Yeah, they moved away. Yeah, this person could be holding on to their money. They could be rich or just have a lot of money. They want to work with you on something, Cancer. Or this could be your energy, Cancer. So you could have Earth, highly aspect, or you could just be grounded. You could be a grounded person. 
just because it's a king don't mean that uh, us feminine energy I mean I'm more masculine but um, so like put it as if it was you so like I have more masculine so this will be me right here type stuff but um, you have to look at your chart in order for you to know all of that so I said that's why I say put it as you put it as if it was you or put it how it resonates you could be a Libra. You could have Libra highly aspect in your chart. You could have two cats that you're not paying attention to. Watch out for y'all cats. Be outside. They could get into fights or they could, um, they could, like, they could, they could get into fights. What the people? So I see the cat. Look, see how this cat look? Watch out for y'all cat, is what I'm doing. If y'all do got cats, somebody want a cat, a kitten, somebody want a kitten, five of cups. I feel like this, this king of pentacles over here feels heartbroken, crying over spilled milk because of a Libra or somebody that got Libra in their chart. Or it could be that somebody needs to balance themselves out. I feel like this king of pentacles needs to balance themselves out with this, with this, uh, this not loving themselves. Hmm. So it could be uh so you could be this Queen of Pentacles. Y'all gonna have a lot of money. Well, it could be the Queen or King of Pentacles. Um that need to show their self love. But I feel like this Queen of Pentacles here. Is, is this Queen of Pentacles is coming in towards this this uh, king over here because he's in this regret energy and he working on something too we gonna figure out what that is but I feel like this Queen of Pentacles could be coming in with some money and things coming to fruition she could be working on her money finances yeah she coming in with a small offer though it could be one, it could be, it could be some money. It's just very small, see? It's just really small. Be mindful of your money, too, because I see that somebody not looking at their money, looking at their bank account, and then they, you know, they don't care. They just like, oh, I got money. I don't care. I'm going to splurge out. And then, you know, somebody could be coming up behind them and trying to rip off them. Don't make big purchases or just be mindful of your purchases, too. Somebody could, somebody could get ripped off or um, somebody could be taking your money, snatching your money, too. So if you take your money out of the bank account, be mindful of your money. Let's get on. Uh... Let's care, let's clarify this King of Pentacles. What's his energy? Okay, so he could be getting some news here. He's gonna be delayed low key, cause it is kind of low key Mercury retrograde a little. He could be a messenger. Yeah, he could be going to talk to his family, the Ten of Pentacles. He could be getting unexpected money here. Somebody could be marrying for pay as well. I see three of cups. Somebody could be cheating on their spouse. That's probably why they're not giving unconditional love. Yeah. Yeah, somebody could be weak, lack, lack of confidence. Like I said, with the lover's card here in reverse, love card. Is in reverse. Somebody could be working on uh getting somebody else in the picture, or they could be already somebody else in the picture because this person doesn't have confidence. Wow, I didn't know that. So this could be you, Cancer. I feel like this is you, and then whoever you're dealing with could be a Queen of Pentacles. Y'all both could have money. Working on your thing. 
and then this king, this king over here is uh, lacking confidence. Yeah, he could be feeling backstabbed from a third party, from a past relationship with a third party here, or he could be working on a third party behind your back. But I'm not really seeing that. I'm seeing that that he he's still reminiscing on the past. That's what I was saying in the beginning of the video. I was saying at the beginning of the video that somebody's not healing from the past, too. It could be that, too. They're playing victim. Yeah, because they thought that, that they thought that the person that they was with was their family. Coming home to, to cooking dinner. All this person did was betray them. Okay, you could be having victory with a Sagittarius here. With the temperance card also i feel like cancer you need to get more balance because you're gonna have victory success here with a with a, a temper with a with a sag is what i'm getting a sag so we did get sagittarius out and we got aquarius so you could be reminiscing on the aquarius from the past or aquarius could be reminiscing on you so how however your story is so like if you got cheated on if cancer, if you got cheated on, um, the Aquarius uh, could feel regretful. Uh, but put it how it resonates. Put it how it resonates. But I feel like you need to be balanced, too, and find yourself. Because I feel like cancer, y'all could get a little too uh, emotional. And then, you know, you, won't, you, you could lack confidence here. So I feel like y'all guys need to focus on yourself and start worrying about a relationship. Even though y'all gonna have victory though. You gonna have victory here. You gonna have victory with balancing yourself. Being patient. Inner calmness. Peace. I feel like y'all need to do that for right now. And just put the Sagittarius, you know, whoever you talking to, to the side. You could be a craze that you reminiscing on, that 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 had a third party, or that you could be Aquarius and then this Cancer could have a third party. So yeah, I feel like you're gonna have victory with this Sagittarius though. But just be mindful that you need to love yourself first before anybody, because y'all could put people first instead of yourselves. A lot so um, just be mindful of the people all right cancer so it was a good reading um, yeah so see you on the next one peace stay blessed be blessed